Welcome back guys to my channel. It is a beautiful day here on the GC today. Look, nothing but clear skies, a few fluffy little clouds up there, but nothing to really worry about. It is an absolutely divine day here on the coast. It's a bit windy and a bit breezy, but you know, who cares about the breeze when it's a 32 degree day and this is your lifestyle. Every day living with the daunting thought of being able to swim every day. Go back to your unit, have some lunch, come back to the pool and just relax. Although today my pain has skyrocketed to about a 9 or a 10. I'm having troubles now with my recto seal. Oh, it's just, oh. a recto seal is where your bowel actually pushes against the back wall of your vagina and onto your bladder. Meaning that I haven't peed for some time and I can't do a decent poo without laying in the bathtub. It's just, and it's really sore. Um, the, really only, the only comfort I do get is laying on my back. And I have done so well at coming off most of my opioids. I'm almost off my Lyrica now. Um, I'm on no other, I'm, I'm off most of my opioids except for the Tarjan. So I'm wrapped about that. Um, so down to 75 milligrams now morning and night with the Lyrica. And still on the 60-30 Tarjan. But unfortunately I think that will remain the same. Because I'm going to have to live with this spinal, spinal issues for the rest of my life. So I just have to learn to adapt and work around and etc. etc. Which I do most of the time anyway. So... I'm doing a fantastic job. I just have to keep maintaining my positivity, which I do. <sighs> it is a beautiful day today. It's just a shame. And I feel like I'm whinging all the time, but just have a go. I don't know whether you can see it on here, but the pool is really, really cloudy. I don't know how much of it you can see. So I'll just shine it back on my beautiful face, shall I? So I just put a video up of the maintenance man putting some chemicals into the pool and you know kids were swimming in there. Now although the mother actually got them out of the pool because she noticed that he was putting some chemicals in and she you know raised her eyebrows to me as if to say what an idiot who does he think he is. That's why I put the question out there to you guys. Please comment back and let me know. Is it safe? To pour in pool chemicals while people are either swimming in the water or about to go for a swim because I don't know these things um, I mean I have been in this complex for almost seven years now and I've not once seen um, the caretaker actually put chemicals in the pool in actual fact I've never seen the pool company put chemicals in the pool um, when there are people swimming um, and there's usually always a sign saying pool closed because of maintenance and people know not to swim in it. Plus they see the bloke, you know, coming out to attend to the pool. So I put it to you guys out there. What is it? Is it normal? Is it okay for people like that idiot to put um, chemicals in the water when people are swimming? Because I simply don't know. And we've got someone else coming to the pool now for a swim, so I won't, and it happens to be a kid, so unfortunately I don't really like to film when children are around, although our privacy is already breached, because let me show you. Yes, I'm going back to the good old camera. See the camera up there? Well, my privacy is already breached with the camera, so you know, young children can swim in here, and all the rest of it but unfortunately their parents should know that they're going to have their children on video camera and God knows what that footage is going to be for so who would know unfortunately but yes would you love to live in this climate it is a beautiful one I do understand that this time of year on the other side of the world we have snow 
Um, we have cold weather here in Australia. It is summer and we are enjoying our the middle midst of our we're in the midst of our summer so it's beautiful here today it reached about 32 degrees there are a few clouds in the sky but um but the wind is rustling about it is just an absolutely beautiful day today so and i haven't done much at all today which is the unfortunate thing I've managed to get myself to the doctors to the chemist to get all my um, script or my prescription drugs dispensed as I have mentioned I'm still on some of the opioids but not a great deal my total aim is to come off the Lyrica entirely come off the Taj entirely and to one day also come off the oh I'm off the others actually so but yeah, it's a beautiful day. Beautiful, beautiful day. So, spin you around to show you more of the Queensland climate. Let's shoot up this way to the shade, I think. Put this way to the shade. I feel like I'm getting a bit burnt there. Our ozone layer. Um, which is directly over Australia, it means that each year we have to make sure we maintain sunscreen and all that type of stuff. Otherwise, um, people are likely to get more skin cancers. So at our place, we do make sure that we spray a good lot of um, sunscreen on. Come for a walk with me. We'll do some walking in the pool, and some kicking and swimming. usually just do some walking around the pool the pool tends to pull my pelvic girdle back in and it also helps too with my back I suppose it helps with um, the discs and how the discs are positioned with the vertebrae fortunately um, I don't have the um, capacity to, I just want to wait because there's a young boy here and I don't really want to have to include him in the video. I don't think he'll appreciate that. A lot of people don't in my complex. <sighs> Where boys, school goes back next week. It is long weekend here in Queensland, which means um, Friday is Australia Day, which is the day that we celebrate Australia's founding by Captain Cook. So usually we all get out and about. We go swimming like this. Um, we put some shrimp on the barbie, as the Americans call it, but we call them, um, we actually call it, call them prawns. They're a lot bigger than shrimp. They're beautiful. So we put some shrimp and we put some lamb on the barbie. There's a few more people coming down now. So guys, I ask that you like my channel, subscribe, and don't forget to hit that notification bell. Until next time, bye for now.